So yes, finally, finally, finally! Though of course we got one, that's a pretty quick. Took about video. So of course I'm gonna go for everything that's new for version Z, pretty much in a nutshell. I'm gonna go for um the juice with the blue slash tipstone, of course for JP and stuff like that. Of course, a little bit tired, so I was kinda um you know, going back and forth and stuff like that though, of course. But yeah, again we got version Z of the game, we got cutscenes we activated, like you know, rear tutorial, cutscenes again, new UI. I'll be active in push for story fit and stuff like that though. Kind of shows active skills like super attacks, like for kind of like cutscenes, kind of purposes and stuff like that though. Pretty cool stuff. Uh, we have a you know, new story mode for like, you know, saying side like, guns, um, smooth like GT, maybe super and stuff like that. We'll probably see that later down the road because that's um, a completely new overhaul, kind of like another thing already. Um, stuff like that, of course. The story and quests um, have been different on the map and on, um, you know, we start the game, we like little quest slash. The store button icon that gets a quest, chain battle, all that stuff. Have been revamped a little bit as well. Um, I think, as well. I think also for what tournament, a lot of people did not mention this. Um, they did get rid of the preliminary rounds, I believe, though, so it was an easy to follow the tournament. They say that, and like, well, the, you know, we're starting with the game and stuff like that. But goal will be really easy because this will come out next year. Coda did, um, you know, reference origin team for JP and stuff like that. It will be coming out next year, though, so that's pretty, pretty cool, though, like that, of course. But, um, yeah, again, just learning stuff in general. Uh, of course, we got missions for all Goku right here. I've been playing new it's like this with Battle Road. Um, new Gear Room update. Um, UI, new teal, so please don't want to go over this video. Uh, we have him to just then get activated all at once now. A uh, new orbit mode for the weekends or on Sundays. I do um, of course, on the map and um, for the map and for the um, of course, um, for the map and of course, like for you know, way tapping on the way tapping back on the bubble screen, of course. Uh, the team slots, so of course, like I said, you have one slot for like five teams. Uh, so for all five teams, again, you're going to build so many teams right now, it's going to be insane. Uh, team costs have been fully removed, again, like I said, auto building, and also when you select a friend, you'll auto select for you, just in case you know, like, full, full service enforcement, you'll probably find like the service support they'll do, or all types of leader or something like that, though, so it's really easy as well. The version of the of course, campaign, um, and then you can just uh, support the campaign as well. UI for the um, easy A, so you can tap it all in one button, though, to them to keep passing. One, two, three, four, five. Like in principle, pretty easy stuff there, of course. Uh, we have the new version 5.0, of course. 5.0.0 update. Again, I want to get that much to be confused. Uh, we have. Um. <clears throat> oh, it looks like rather all over the place right now. Hey, we should also, you know, when you guys are in, but when you just remember, we have all four dudes. But okay, you're able to do it now or something like that. Uh, you can't, you know, you still go back and remember the unit, but I'll tell you specifically now you guys remember the unit. We have all four copies already there for you, so it's really good and stuff like that, of course. Uh, really good stuff. Uh, this one is for when you um, clear, like when you clear the heart, um, all you gotta do is like basic, all of those things to be quick for you, so you get all stones in one. So you can get things like this. Three stages, you get all three stones again, but you can farm a little bit more easier, especially for the quest stage. And that has been updated, now I've been updated in 5,000 years. So, pretty good stuff for you, I'm assuming. Um, so yeah, and of course I think right here was we did a season campaign, the key to the back so you can get, um, the, um, how about, how about the time to invest out and use one stone instead of ten, we, um, unlike the potential world, so you guys can go back and do that, pretty easy principle. I heard that wasn't permanent, but it was at the same time, I don't know. So of course we can go over the tail side, but boost down, but yeah, it's only available for 400 hours as a new player, or, um, as the original you know, so I think, I think I opened the campaigns up. And the blue slash tail stone will be available around the time though. It's only for like I think like hundred slash forty or thirty bucks. I can't remember though. Um, but that thing is really good because you can get a get most stone deal. I recommend doing that if like you will play your edition or strength out because it's like okay, I'll get a whole bunch of stones, save up for something, maybe you knew about it for a long time. It's like okay, I'm gonna set up stones or whatever, but if you have a new player, you don't know what to get with you. I think it's pretty simple, pretty easy though, of course. Um but yeah. Uh, of course, all the units you can get are available in for all of them. This one's are good, which is bad. They're actually all pretty good. Like, LRK on Twitter really good. Um, Guy Goku is still decently solid. Um, L yeah, um, not LRK, not LRK Guy Goku down here, but, I mean, it's cool. I mean, you are Goku. That's you are Goku right there. I'll be with a play, I don't know about that. He's really good. You can literally just, you know, Goku, 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 Goku. Uh, enemy of Goku, Goku, Va Goku. Okay, yeah, it's very, 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 very typical stuff, though, of course. Um, but yeah. Um, again, all those stuff like that, of course. Um, yeah, gonna just go over what you need to get and stuff like that again. Probably make it very simple, very fast, and very easy, of course, though. But yeah, uh, LR Count Khalifa are really, really good LR and Jerry Rollo. Um, again, they have each really, really well. Again, ever since they first came out, um, <coughs> ooh, 
ever since they first came out and everything of course they actually have been, have been really good um even nowadays i'll tell you you've been loving the goku events they're really good they're disgusting they're crazy and stuff like that they're really worth the unit to get probably um then probably you like goku really worth to get again it's a lot of good units on the um, team and stuff like that and age a little bit though but i still like using them personally like i like how it's like a really viable unit they come on a lot of teams they're disgusting they're crazy um we're using them with like that again they'll rack up their key they'll rack up their dodging um not really crit though, but it's really just dodging. Just, a lot of additional more text you can for, of course. Like I said, you'll get like four or five additional skills with them. You get a lot of fun and value out of them as you use them more and more and more. And also, you have multiple copies. You can't execute the SSR, QR, and L1 though, so it's actually like, you're feeling really, really worth it. Am I video circle? Okay, it is. Okay, I'm not sure. But um, yeah, you can SSR, QR, and L1 are actually going to be really worth it and stuff like that though. So, um, yeah, I highly recommend volume game demos because they're really, really good. It's all that, of course, like I said though. Um, but yeah, though, um, very, very simple, very, very easy to get spot that they'll get for the real players again. If you want to get full same team, or because a lot of people are like trying to make the same team character they're going to do, I like them for really work that they're really good at support the unit and stuff like that. Probably highly recommend getting them and stuff like that though, of course. But yeah, um, again, they're going to be really good for you to spell select up your sands. Again, they'll be 15 to 5 per sands, you know, or you know, for spell select up your They'll pretty much dodge 24 7. Again, I guess you like good because they will be stable though, but um, it's gonna be really good for regular defense for that again. They barely can even be touched like they go up that though, so um also battle road. It's a battle road probably not as much though because you're not gonna see the effectiveness effectiveness there though, but still really good worth it, you know, overall though. Again, probably recommend highly game this year though, really good. Okay. Um, yeah, basically, being like the same base team, but whatever, though, this one's really good. In terms of power, you know, versus Ball Saka, this is a really good category size units, you know, units, units and categories again. A lot of this year and last year for them. Really good stuff, of course. On to, I think, LR Bully though. Uh, another really key unit again has aged if I want to say a little bit though, because a lot of people don't really talk about him that much though, but yeah, it's another really, really good worth it unit. Uh, yeah, Razor of the Warriors, like, you don't have to like involve the team that much. I have tried to do them myself though, I have them like with the rest of the Warriors and stuff like that though. But a lot of people don't really talk about transformation that much either though, because a lot of people just want transformation 247 though. But again, another really worth it unit probably to get maybe. Again, probably not highly though, but he's really, really good for the team, which is the fuck that though. Even though like, it doesn't affect the event or whatever, or just in general. I think he's really good though. Like I said, though, for I'm a little bit about that. A pretty good unit, pretty decent unit, and stuff like that. Like I said, probably don't really recommend picking up one. So, again, he's pretty okay nowadays, to why that though. But again, probably not really worth it. Maybe kind of a trophy prize we pick him up, though. But he's still really good unit to pick up. If you really, if really, really want like really teams. But unfortunately, I say he has started to eat a little bit, though. So, probably really don't recommend picking him up like a new player and stuff like that, though. But all Goku, Goku, like, all Goku, on the other hand, is a really good skill for pure higher percent. It's pretty easy to stuff like that, though. Again, he can rock the damage pretty well. But it does take him a little bit of time, though. But, um, I don't really know, because I think in after a couple of times he does his passive does start, does start to kind of run out there. Also, you could get some, you would get, you would get a lot of use out of like Super Battle Road. And, um, I go back to Battle Road, even though it's still, nowadays pretty easy ish nowadays. I'm like, difficult, I'm still sort of struggle with that, even being in the first one. But we got a lot more units, a lot more stuff again. He can be really good for that team, though, compared to Hyper Sands, because the real skill overall, though, um, damage output and stuff like that's gonna be really good. Again, you can get a pair of sick, like, pure, uh, like, piercing or ever since I'm on the team, but you bring it, the team's disgusting, both of them are related to the end, they'll get into it. But, um, yeah, again, another good solid unit that I'll probably recommend getting, though. Again, I can spend too, too long on this guy, though, but he's pretty decently good. I probably recommend we'll be getting him. But yes, okay, you also can use SSR, TO and LR. It might not be as effective for you, though, but if you want to go ahead and get them for pitch purposes and just like them all together, um, Decently worth it though. I'll say he's really decently worth it though. Probably get him though. So yeah. Off the next unit, I think it's Rose. He does have probably one of the best break points in the game. He does just of course if he's really good, really, really good, work with the damage really well. Again, he can do a lot like Oh, he just do so much damage though. Okay, that's that just that's worth like damn, but in general he's really good. But Overall, though, I'd say he's actually HG. He's actually aging pretty well, but I think it's, it's just, it's just really just need to support, though. Like, we can later, like, support Spike Future and stuff like that, though. He's gonna be really good and worth it, though. If he's really good, he's really worth it to get, honestly, though, as a villain. I think he's probably worth it to get, but again, like I said, though, he does have the best rate in the game and stuff like that. Um, pretty much, though, him and like, oh, maybe he has the best rate mode, because he only gets to, like, maybe one or two turns, but, um, we can work the unit again, like I said, probably one of the best family units in the game right here. But again, he just unfortunately, unfortunately just needs help because he can do a lot of damage. He's actually really good, but again, he needs a lot. He just he really just needs support in the gym, bro. So he pretty much needs that. But I see he's really worth it. I say probably come up though, he's actually really worth it to get though. Um on the team. Him kill oh, okay, Goku is really good. Maybe got Goku. Goku is okay and decent though, but probably really don't recommend it. I want to step him over for a though, honestly. I know he's like really good this guy, you know, being villain or whatever though, but he's actually really good. Again, really really good unit. 
um, on to, I think, I lost the wrong book, Goku. Um, unfortunately, he is starting to age up a little bit, a little bit though, but his Super Saiyan team is really good. He do a lot. You're able to look at him before in general with the Super Saiyan category allies and your team and stuff like that, though. His pretty much going to be really good there, though. Unfortunately, he has a little bit of stuff like that is as good, but he's going to he's gonna wreck up a lot of damage. He's going to he's gonna wreck up a lot of damage. He's really good for Super Saiyan and stuff like that in general, though. But, um, yeah, again, who really you need to use it to what that, like I said. Um, but yeah, though, um, a really good unit, really good for Super Saiyans. Again, he's probably gonna be great for my team though. He's gonna be really good. I think I love Gohan because you know, basically, you know, they're giving the same team and stuff like that. They have that thing. They have a Super Saiyan 2 one, they have an HL one. I'm um, thinking pretty good to get though because he's a Super Saiyan character though, but I think the only XE, I think they're actually pretty decent together though, but um, yeah, also, unfortunately, he has a he has strong age for his defense, though. But I think he's a really good structure unit, though. It's really much fun. Again, right now, most of his hands, again, he has a whole bunch of different teams like the Mallets and stuff like that, though. But he's, well, he's okay as well, but I probably really don't recommend picking him up, though. I'll say yes and no, because he has a really good unit and stuff like that, though. But um, unfortunately, I won't say he has starting to kind of pick up a little bit, though. But again, if you want to run a Super Saiyan team, Super Saiyan's team, maybe he's more Super Saiyan team, maybe. I think he's actually really decent with what they're trying to get though. Yeah, he's gonna be a really lot of good teams, a lot of good stuff to get really on. Um, some bar and stuff like that though, of course though. But he's pretty decent as real ball though. So again, probably really don't recommend picking up him yes and no kind of, but probably really don't recommend it though. So yeah. LR, LR of course, um you had Goku. But the last one again, probably the best one actually just gonna be though. He's really, really good, really disgusting game. He first came out for the internet again. Um just so many memes and stuff like that, I don't know. But yeah, okay, literally, you are Goku literally broke my internet, okay? So yeah, I literally broke my people. So yeah, again, um, he's really getting unique and really good for most gods. He's really good for all of us. So of course, with Battle Royals, he's close to me out. He's like the top five. Was it worth it? You can probably get out of everybody, though. He actually is really good. Um, again, a lot of good, pretty decent links and stuff like that, of course. Um, pretty good units about the overall, though, of course, though. But yeah, he's a really good. Probably recommend getting him and stuff like that, though. So yeah. Um, but with summary, though, um, again, all the are really good. They're on their own. Like, you know, Cliff are really good. Uh, Bro is really decently good. Um, you like Goku. I probably say, like, Rose, you like Goku, you make Young Cliff up. And maybe, like, I Goku, because they're all actually really good. I know Bro, again, um, I've always Bro and this Goku have finished a little bit, though, but, um, it's pretty much all my recommendations, all my thoughts, stuff like that. But yeah, again, Kill Cliff are really worth it to get, probably. Uh, you like Goku, um, down here. And of course, like I said, I'm Rose and stuff. Like so, pretty much, I'm gonna go ahead and do that video. So, yeah. See you guys later, though. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Enjoy the session. Watch and God bless all of you. Of course, not play my best. So, what do you think about this? Of course, I'm going to sleep. I'm really tired and everything. Of course, just say you're doing this video. I'm going to upload it when I'm done, though. So, see you guys later, though.